if a mother has a sick child, the mother is living in a very uh, desperate poverty. No sanitation and very limited access, if any, to clean drinking water. Tuberculosis passes easily there, malaria passes easily there, pneumonias circulate easily there. The typical scenario is when the child is really, really sick, she'll come here. Now, of course, to get here, most likely she has to carry her child here. Our goal is try to do what another institution cannot do and what the family of the child cannot do. That's our goal. When a child comes, it's very important that that care is good and that is permanent. We have emergency room, we have the ambulatory clinic, malnutrition ward. Maternity for high-risk pregnancies, we have neonatology, intensive care unit, pediatric surgery, and HIV AIDS, rehydration room slash cholera. We have the only oncology department for children in the country. What's made St. Damien successful is we've always found partners for the next step. Very often the partners are sharing equipment and their knowledge. It's been the goal to offer in Haiti what's not here. That's been the goal. So we develop toward the goals as we find help. Une fillette de 6 ans qui est avec nous depuis à peu près un an pour une leucémie lymphoblastique aiguë. Mais cependant, l'enfant a très bien répondu à la chimiothérapie. Actuellement, elle est en rémission. Elle est en phase de maintien. Même j'ai un soulagement parce que et puis j'ai été été malade. Je dis après bon, je sais pas docteur, je me dis qu'elle a perdu. C'est guérison maison. Le traitement complet de la leucémie, dans le type de leucémie, dure 30 mois. Mais c'est un enfant qui sera, ensuite elle sera en surveillance, donc elle sera là jusqu'à 18 ans avec nous. C'est un enfant pour le moment qui a un pronostic assez bon. We try to do what nobody else is offering here because it's, it's a desperate need. We want to be able, without flinching and without hesitating, we want to be able to do the right thing. I appreciate the hospital to be able to do the right thing. Because I've been here, I've got a solution. The mother goes the extra mile and she's here and we can take her so far and then we need help to go the extra mile you know 20 20 percent of those children need help that even we it's not in our budget for those things we can do it but we can't afford 20 percent of the kinds of problems we can't afford it we cannot accommodate all the children referred to us we are right now at the crossroad where we see the needs for more special care and it's not available elsewhere. More than ever, we need now to provide the next step of pediatric care to the population we serve. The highest level of care in pediatrics that can be offered here, we offer it and we want to be able to continue doing that and we need that support to be able to do it.